everything. All right, guys, we're back in manage packages with NPM. We are doing, let's see here, I believe it's uh, disk tag removal. Yes, so we're in disk tag removal. Almost done with this section. Going piece by piece. Sorry, my hands are a little wet. Just to did dishes real quick. So now we've added disk tagger two. Let's clean things up. You can't remove is the latest. That's because every package has the latest tag by default, but you can change the latest. So uh, let's delete all the tags that we can and point latest to the other. So I believe, if I remember correctly, if we do npm disk dash so disk dash tag, uh, npm. We only have one disk tag, we have a latest. So uh, what we wanna do is actually move that disk tag, the latest one, to, uh, oh, that's what it is, npm disk dash tag ls. It's like, so you'll see right now we have latest and we have test. So the first thing we need to do is remove test. The way that we do that, we see disk dash tag, or npm disk tag so now that i know we're messing around with disk tags we then need to say where we're removing that that's at ct360 slash ct360 yours may be at whatever your username is slash your workspace now from here we're gonna do something a little bit different we're not going to include the version number to remove it excuse me i forgot to do uh it's disk tag rm remove at the location CT360, and then the tag, which in this case is test. And you'll see right here this minus showcasing that it just got removed. Now, if you're you're not a believer, we can do and you can go ahead and just to double check and we did. Which, by the way, I double check shit all the time. I know with 99.9% .9 accuracy that it worked. Um, uh, and uh, just because I, you don't want to be, I don't know. Just because I'm paranoid, I guess. So you'll see that we have the latest disk tag. So we only have one disk tag. Now, how do we actually move that? It's similar to just adding. There can only be one one disk tag, right? So instead, what we want to do is npm disk tag, add, and then we're going to name the package at ct360 slash ct360. Now at, instead of going to our current version, we're going to go back to the old version and we're going to put the tag latest. And you'll see now when we go uh, dis, npm dis tag ls, we can see that it worked just fine. So npm dis dash tag ls, you'll see 1.0.0. Um, and so uh, it's now in the old version. So now we can go to how dash two dash verify uh, or how dash two dash npm verify. We can, we're done. So what do we need to take away from this? Well, we need to take away the fact that we can add uh, disk tags, which we learned last time, but we can add, if we have a disk tag such as latest, we can add to move it. We just need to add it elsewhere. We also know how to remove, and then we also know how to list all of our disk tags. So um, keep that in mind when you're working with these disk tags. As always, guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, and support me on Patreon. Thank you to those of you who do. It means the absolute most to me and i will see you guys in the next video thanks for watching special thanks to our sponsor dev mountain if you're interested in a coding boot camp why don't you check them out where they include housing alongside their tuition so you can get up go and immerse yourself in the environment if you want to support me go over to patreon.com slash coding tutorials 360 so we can put out more content thanks for watching